having a new video that is about to creating an HTML compiler. In the last video, we have created a color code application uh, within a uh, few minutes. And now we have uh, a new thing that is a HTML compiler using HTML, CSS, JS within 10 minutes. And believe me, that is for beginners. No, no much, much knowledge of HTML and CSS, JS is required. Just a couple of things you have to know and we can start. So in the last video, we directly started to develop the uh, application and we directly started to coding. And now uh, this time we will think over that how to make that application. So for that, we have, uh, I mean, we're gonna create two text areas. One is for HTML, one is for CSS and get the value of uh, HTML text area put that value into a div which you going to execute as inner HTML using JavaScript. Now get the value from CSS text area, put that value into the style as inner HTML using JavaScript. So that is all, boom. Now, now we can start that uh, what we want to design. So let's come here. Uh, this is my index.html and this is a basic HTML structure you can see. Right. So, uh, how to make a basic uh, HTML structure? I have already covered into the last video. So now for that, as we have already discussed, that we're gonna create two text areas. So let's type two text areas, text uh, text area. We gonna give the placeholders that HTML goes here. Dot, 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 and that's it. And uh, okay, so this is uh, the text area. So if we are going to see the window, this is how it will be uh, working. Okay, so now uh, we can do the the on key up as we did in the earlier video on this we gonna create like a, da, 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 compile html passing with this object okay so this is calling a function and we have to create a function into the head so let's type script and this script we call function, function name is this. And in that we have two things, that is field and event. And in this, we have to get the value of this text area and put into the execution div. So for that, we have to create a div id will be output. And here we can do this document dot get element by ID and the ID is output. So now we have this output div and we want to create the inner HTML of this output div as field dot value. Sounds good. Let's play this. Okay, so here I'm gonna write h1 heading and you can see that it's working. Some more text. Great. Okay, so here that we can see that we have already created an HTML compiler. For CSS compiler, we have to create one more text area. And writing CSS goes here. Compile with CSS. We have to create one more method like this. Compile CSS. And instead of output, we're gonna create a style tag here. Wherever you want. I mean, Better to write in the start of the body, 
this is the styling and that's it save it and now we can see two text areas one is h1 heading and here we can write h1 background RGB let's say black and color white and text align center and padding and red px so this is how it's working let's do some styling to make this app look better so how are we gonna do this we gonna have this two text area within a single div style was to display flakes okay you can see this yeah so and we need to style this also so this style um, flex one and height hundred pix and that is it. So copy and paste save. So let's deal with this. Yes, it's looking fine now. Now it's one. Heading. So if we already have these snippets, we can copy these things like this. Copy, paste, like heading and ULLI. And for the CSS, we can like this. Copy this. You can see everything is working. We can tap here for the paragraphs. Graphs, close and tab for styling. P color red. That is it. So this is how you know that how to create a HTML compiler using HTML CSS and JS. And I think it's an interesting thing that we can do. And I hope that uh, you like this video. And if you really like this video, please subscribe my channel and wait for the for the videos. Thank you so much.